Uh huh. Oh, let's go, Jolene. Save her, man. Hi, welcome to Master Jojo Part Six, Episode Seven. Yay! Whoa! So, ladies and gentlemen, last episode was mainly Ermi's focus. Of course, where we get to see her stand, basically got got kids, but apparently the anime got smacked for some reason. But you can say it was a really interesting episode. To see how she used her, you know, her stand. In this case, using stickers to like, you know, when to take out Merce thing together, smack them together, which you know can injure them, of course. So, yeah, it was a really interesting episode. Get to see how she can, you know, be a good ally to Jolene, which maybe in today's episode we can see them working together, of course. So, you know, last episode, we get to see the janitor, which basically he has the disc in him. Basically, he's working with the pale snake, whatever that thing is again. So, yeah, I'll be looking forward to see how those two are going to work together to solve the mystery of the disc problem, of course. So, let's get started, shall we? So, episode 7, here we go. Netflix. I gotta say, it feels really weird watching JoJo like literally one episode at a time because usually you have to wait a week. Oh ho ho! Shit! Why you have to? Why to crush your heart again by looking at this scene again? Uh huh. So basically, Jolene's being mature now. He's staying behind to help save his safer father. <laughs> uh huh. Jolene. Uh huh. Ujo, Jolene, they're gonna work together on this, man. I'm pretty sure they can be good friends, too. Like, in any Jojo series, you have allies to work with. Mm hmm Okay. So, it worked. So, the disc actually helped save life. So, yep, they need to get the disc back from, from the guy that stole it. Or the stand that stole it. Mm -hmm. Oh, you have both discs. Wow. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's fun to know, I guess. Mm -hmm. Yep. Pay also neck man of whoever that guy is they have to deal with. So I guess they have really had to get cracking with it. Yeah. Mm hmm Well, I don't think it'll be that easy though, because I think there's gonna be another stand of enemies to come. To stop them, of course. Oh ho ho whoa, what's going on here? What's coming? Oh What's going on here? Oh ho ho ho, okay. Um, uh, yeah, wow. Oh my god, seems like they're gonna die, man. They're gonna die. They're gonna die. Oh. Oh, oh shit! Oh my god! Ah, uh, they're fucked. Oh, oh no! Okay, holy shit! Here comes your gory stuff, man. What the fuck, man? Oh, why is that? Ay, ay, ay! Wow, it seems like it's some sort of like stand that, that attacks farm places. So let's just see how this episode goes. There are six of us. Six of us? Like, okay, I thought there's like three of them. Huh. Well, let's just see how this episode go. <laughs> okay, seems like they had to solve that farm place with the two inmates. Hmm. <laughs> Hey, Jolene! Oh, ho, 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 yo, time for action, I guess. Mm hmm. I think it's some sort of stand that works in the swamp or something, from what I can see. 
Mm -hmm. Yeah, it seems like you're asking about the inmates and Jolene and pretty much Ermi is going to volunteer. <laughs> Oh, there's a lot more this time. Okay, there's a lot more. Okay, I thought you only need to... And Jolene, of course, man. <laughs> and of course, she, I think she knew Jolene's going, so she said, yeah, let's just tag along. <laughs> mm -hmm. Does she want to, I guess? Wait, right, I thought there's six. I think there's one more, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, so no escaping. Like a virgin. Mm-hmm. Mm hmm Oh shit. Well, it seems like they don't they cannot remove it. If you remove it, they just like suicide squad, you explode. Mm-hmm. I mean, they gotta have something like that as a precaution though, you know, inmates after all, they can escape. What the fuck? Uh, they're walking? Wow. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. <laughs> I know, right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> wow. Low. Yeah, it's such in discrimination, indeed, right? Discrimination. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm there we go, man. Time to get involved with her problem. <laughs> mm hmm Mm hmm Mm -hmm. Well, guess he was the one involved after all, but putting a disc inside of him. I think his ability to extract, like, you know, stand and insert stand, like the arrow, I guess. Wow, okay. <laughs> Mm -hmm. I mean, of course. Or oh, maybe he has a, another stash of it though. Maybe he gets you a title one special, which you can't mention it to. So, yeah. Oh, yeah, avoiding the topic. Yeah, where did she put Jotaro's body? Back in the submarine or something? Well, okay, seems like she's really trying to avoid the topic of the father. You know, you, you, the more you ask, the more sad she gets, I guess. Oh, here we are, guys. That's, that's the place. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. These policemen are like assholes, indeed, man. I think you know, prison police are always an assholes. <laughs> hey. Oh shit. What's she up to, man?
Oi, okay. What the fuck? Oh my god, seriously. This po this police money is an ass, man. Mm hmm Oh uh, yeah, it was so non purpose. Oh cut the chit chat, you stu asshole. Mm-hmm. Oh my god, Jolene, do something about it, man. Use a stand to punish this asshole. Oh, you see, use a stand. Mm hmm. Oh my god, seriously. Oh my god, seriously. This asshole, man. Ah, there we go. Thank you, Jolene. Thank you. Haha, -ha, nice. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Ah, pissed off! Pissed off, you dickhead! <laughs> Prison guard, no, you pissed off, you dickhead! Pissed off, man, you deserve that, man. These police here are assholes, man. I mean, it's JoJo. What do you expect? Oh. Okay. What are they up to? Hmm. Yeah, the tractor is the one that got them killed, right? Mm hmm. Oh, she said the tractor is the one that has a disc. Oh, ho, 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 ho. well, seems that like they found it. Mm hmm. Well, let's just see whether they can find this in there. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Really now, going to the war, you know, war of crocodiles there, and I could, I think the stand could also be in the war. Mm hmm. Uh huh. Yes. What? What? I think she sent something. No, I, I don't need to tire. Yeah, I don't think it's a tire, man. Uh huh. Hmm. Uh huh. There's six. Oh, wait. Now, now you think about it. Now that you think about it, who's in posture? Oh my god. Yo. Yo, that's imposture. Okay. <laughs> oh, ha, ha, ha. now this is some sort of detective show. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Well, we have an imposture. I mean, your typical Jojo scenario where they solve problems, I guess. <laughs> hmm? Oh, ho ho. Mm -hmm. What's going on? Uh, oh, I knew it. He's in that war. He got taken down. Oh my god. Let me guess. He got attacked by the stand or something. Oh, he's dead. Oh shit. He's dead. <laughs> guess he's bounded all the way down in the war, man. He, he's a goner. Mm hmm. Oh. 
Oh shit! It's explode! Oh shit! Oh! Oh sh Oh my god! Oh what? Oh holy shit! They weren't kidding around exploding bracelets, man. Oh, I, w I guess she was a bit further away from them, so they had to stay close there, I guess. Oh, shit. Some oh, there he is. Oh, there's now five of them, I guess. Uh-huh. That was a real psycho. Hmm. <laughs> Well, I mean, her eyes look suspicious, though, I gotta say. <laughs> mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh, 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 ho, 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 yo, it's here, I guess. Hey, nothing. Or oh, could it be one of those stand water, like we can dive amongst the water and stuff like that. Well, I guess that's how they became allies, I guess. Sticking together, looking out for each other's back. <laughs> oh, she's gone. Ah! Oh, ho, 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 ho. well, that's... Well, there we go, guys. Oh, it was the bucket all along. I knew it. It's a stand that can go inside some more war or something. Oh, my God. What the fuck? Oh shit! It's a parasite like stat. Oh my god! It's a parasite. So sad. Oh god! Ah oh, no! Jesus Christ! Oh my god! What the fuck, man? Oh. Smack! Aha! There we go. Oh, ho, 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 ho. you shit, man. Huh? Oh my god. Oh shit, he can explode. He's gonna make him explode. That's his purpose, man. That's the, pu that's the purpose of the stand. Hey! Nice. Uh-huh. Oh, let's go, Jolene. Saved her, man. Oh my god. Yo, look at her go, man. Although the more she used, the more skin. I think she's using more skin when the more she uses stand. Oh, damn. Hey. hey. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh. oh, shit. Oh. Oh. Oh god. Oh shit. Mm -hmm. the oh hey, there we go. Mm hmm Oh nice man. Oh nice. Oh yeah, that's the girl. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Don't stand up. Grab it under water. Uh huh. Oh ho ho. Okay. Uh huh. 
So let it fight underwater or something. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh, right. Here enough. Oh, oh, ho, ho, nice. Ouch. Ouch, okay. That was sharp thinking from Ermis, man. Uh huh. And retreat. Retreat for now, I guess. Hmm. I mean, duh. I think it's the red shirt. Mm hmm. Hmm. I do wonder who is it though. Mm hmm. I mean, I did have a sneak look at who is it though. Oh wow! Since I didn't wait for the next episode for it. Well, okay, that was one hell of a way to end up the episode with a bit of a cliffhanger, you know, letting us to know that the next episode we're going to expose who is it. Although I did went back to the episode and see who was the one that fainted. So it was indeed the girl with the ponytail or basically the one, you know, calling for help and stuff like that. So yeah, she's just trying to disguise herself, I guess. Well, I got to say though, you know, it was nice to see Ermes and Jolene working together. Well, that's a sign that those two are starting to become good allies. I mean... Of course, you know, her room is working with Jolene because, you know, she wanted to get closer to the disc and stuff like that. They were getting closer to the disc before, you know, the whole incident with the pond and stuff like that. But I'm pretty sure, you know, next episode with the one that, you know, was after them exposed herself and, you know, seeing the fact that, you know, she had, was working with, I think, the pale snake. So she was just there to make sure that they don't get closer to the disc. So I'm pretty sure that would, would be the explanation for next episode. But... Well, it was nice to see Jolene power to extend though, because you know, see, you know, it's the more she used the power, the the more skin she uses, I guess. I mean, exposing her inside. I mean, yes, it can help her to avoid like you know serious injuries, like the you know the punch in the stomach. But I do wonder is there like a bigger limitation? I mean, is there like a limit to how much she can use the stand or something? Like you know, the more she used, the more skin, you know, the more she uses her skin, and she become more exposed and more easy to you know cut down. I guess. Well, we shall see, man. But. Well, it was nice to see, you know, Jolene and, you know, Ermes, like, really working together, you know, fighting against this, you know, stand that involves in the war, which, you know, was kind of hard to fight. But seeing how much, you know, those two kind of trust each other for the time being, though, was really nice, though, especially, you know, she's saving, you know, Ermes from the poop incident with the policeman. So, well, I mean, it seems like we're going to find out who's the one involved in their incident the next episode, and I can't wait to see how are they going to expose her. I mean, I'm pretty sure they say, I mean, they, you know, maybe they attack the stand and she responds to it or something. Or maybe, you know, since Jolene can kind of have a sneak look at it, you know, the girl with the ponytail. So I, I feel like, you know, it will be her anyway. So yeah, looking forward to the next episode. I, pre I really do feel like, you know, Hell Snake may also show up because they could, they're getting closer to the disc too. So, well, we shall see you next episode, of course. I gotta say, so far, I am really liking the fight scene. I mean, the war fight scene though. And of course, you know, when it's the moment you see the bucket and stuff like that, it kind of reminds me of the stand used back in the part five with the with something involving the war and stuff like that. So I was like, oh, could be something similar to that. I wish I was right, of course. So yeah, moving on to episode eight now. And I'm pretty sure things are about to get interesting. So let's go, shall we?